All right, guys, welcome to This Is Will's Way again. I am Will. I'm wearing a strong and pretty 2021 shirt. Um, but yeah, I just want to say that uh, your past does not define your future. That's the biggest one. Don't let don't let it define your future. You know, we all go through things, but every day is a new start. So with that being said, you know, you just start all over, clean slate. Morning, get up. If you didn't do your routine right the day before, or anything you had going for yourself, just keep on keeping on. Keep on trying to accomplish those goals within the same time frame. Because something always comes up, right? You're always going to go through some kind of little struggle or something here and there. So yeah, that's, that's today's... And, you know, don't let your past define your future. If anything, you learn from it. Or you can just clean it out completely. Get rid of it. Just get it out of the head. Completely. Also, that also leads to, you know, wiping people out of your life if you have to. Not like literally like, you know, getting rid of them or killing them. But, oh, right now I'm reading Darren Greatly. I finished uh, Grant Cardone's book. I read The Rational Mail. Um... And that was a pretty good book. It was preventive medicine. How it is understanding basically how men have to live in a world where it's actually a lot tougher than 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 the way we're brought up. You know, we we're brought up to follow certain rules and things like that. So um, that aren't really necessary, especially as guys, as leaders. Um, you gotta kind of push past those boundaries. But yeah, read the rational note. Read the first, first book. I'm on the second book, Preventive Medicine. It's a pretty darn good book. Highly recommend it to all the guys out there um, that need to read a good read for their life. That's pretty life changing. Um, and then, yeah. So right now I'm reading Darren Greatly. So uh, this book is kind of probably gonna go over. And as far as what I was reading a little bit, just teaching uh, leadership and how to be vulnerable at the perfect time and to kind of go all in, you know, take risks. Um, but yeah, no, it's just, uh, I'm going to keep reading on and give you guys a full book review after that. But yeah, but I guess I read the read Rational Mills book review, the second book, Preventive Medicine. Um, but yeah, no, there's a lot of good insight in there uh, about just just how we have to live in a constructed world where certain rules are invited to to make men not stand up, not stand out in a crowd. So, so yeah, and then uh, yeah, so yeah, going back to. Um, like today I was reading this, I read that book yesterday. Um, getting back into your routine, getting back into your habits. Don't let your past define your future. You know, if you have a past of smoking, doing any bad things to start with that, at least get get these bad addictive habits out of your life. Start with clean slates. You guys can do it. You know. But yeah, so pretty much what I want to say. I guess I did a book review and I also uh, did a little bit of uh, talking about, you know, a motivational quote. So, yeah, don't let your past define your future. And keep on keeping on. Oh, going back to wiping people out. Don't wipe them out literally. <laughs> I go all over the place when I start talking sometimes and I just need to really focus on one topic I'll get better um, but yeah just always focus on the future never let your past define anything and don't wipe anybody out <laughs> you wipe my mindset right you can also exclude them out of your network if they're negative toxic people which is you know or you can include them because you can learn from them too right learn why does this person think this way why is it such a such a negative, such have such a negative impact on me. Why does it have, you know, 
just always keep on getting better, becoming better at every single thing. So, um, I tend to kind of step away from those bad people a bit. I mean, I learned from them, yeah. I remember, it's like you learn from them and then like, you know you're progressing in life. You know you have to move. You know you have to move around them. You can't keep holding on to them. So, so yeah. No, much happier. Much happier. Yeah, guys. Keep on keeping on. This is Will's way. Keep him strong and pretty. 2021. That's Robert O'Burst's brand. I don't know. Maybe I'll put a link in the description. I don't know. I really like that guy. <laughs> He's a strong man. Those are the strong men, guys. Eddie Hall, Brian, Brian Shaw. All those guys are hilarious. All right, guys. Keep on keeping on.